so the lower end of this strip is on the line and upper end is on the line where y equal to a so we will move this strip from this point till this point okay but when the strip is in this region the lower end of the strip is on the circle and upper end of the strip is on the line y equal to a but when it crosses this point after circle we have line so this is divided into two regions at this point so this will be region r1 this will be region r2 okay so the region r1 is from this point so this is region r1 so in region r1 we will consider one strip parallel to y axis lower end of the strip is on the circle so y will be equal to root of a square minus x square and the upper end is on the line y equal to a and here we are going from x equal to 0 till this point what is this point this point is nothing but x equal to a so now if you see first we have limit for x and then we have limits for y now we will have the limits for y first and then for x so our region r1 limits are y is going from circle to line y equal to a and x is going from this point till this point only that is x is going from 0 to a this is for region r1 the same thing we will do for region r2 in region r2 lower end of this strip is on the line so lower end is on the line x equal to y plus a then y will be x minus a and the upper end of this strip is on the line y equal to a so the upper end is y equal to a and we have to cover this region r2 so this region r2 is starting from this point and it is ending on this point so this point is x equal to a and it is ending on this point so what is this point to find this point we have to put y equal to a because this line is nothing but y equal to a so we put y equal to a in this equation we will get a equal to x minus a we will get x equal to 2a so this point is represent x equal to 2a so we are moving this strip from x equal to a to x equal to 2a to cover the region r2 so region r2 have limits y equal to line that is y equal to x minus a to y equal to a line and x we are going from a to 2a so these are our new limits so over this integration after changing the order it will become two integrations one for region r1 one for region r2 so in region r1 we have limits going from root of a square minus x square and y equal to a and x is going from 0 to a and here we write the same thing which was given in the question that is f of x comma y dx dy and here we will have the limits for region r2 in r2 y is going from x minus a to y equal to a and x is going from a to 2a and this thing will remain same so this is how we change the order of integration in this if you see we have first limit with respect to y that is we are first integrating with respect to y and second we are integrating with respect to x in the question it was first integration is with respect to x and the second integration is with respect to y so this is how we change the order of integration the basic procedure is first find what is the order of integration then from first integration draw the diagram and find the region on which this integration is happening after finding this region you have to change the order of integration in that if we have strip parallel to x-axis then we will consider strip parallel to y-axis and we cover the same region which was given so this is how we solve the problem on changing the order of integration this is without evaluation more such problems we will see in our next video, so stay tuned for our future lectures.